Welcome back to a good day. We're all busy running around, working, taking care of our families. But what's the one thing we don't stop and do every day? Get affirmation that we're doing okay. We have immense strength and can make profound impacts in our and others' lives. Author, speaker, life coach, and so much more. Kay Flowers joins us this morning. Thank you so much for being here today. Yes, thank you so much for having me. Absolutely. So we were just talking. You're originally from California. You've been yes. here in the BG area for a little bit. So welcome to the area. Thank you. Thank you. And um, tell me a little bit about your background and, and what inspired you to write this book. Yeah, so a little bit about me. Um, I'm originally, like we said, it from California. I'm a creative, so writing has always been a part of me um, having like uh, journals always writing and finding uh, different outlets to express myself mm -hmm. so that's um, really a huge part and then I'm a wife I'm a mother my daughter just turned one like a couple weeks ago oh, and my so goodness. yeah it goes fast oh yeah it's they tell you that. it really yeah. does mine just started kindergarten it happens oh, so my gosh. yeah you know but the, this book in, in particular is you know about finding that affirmation because so many times we don't we don't stop to think like yeah we're doing okay right right so talk a little bit about this book and what's in it oh yeah absolutely so it does I uh, I have affirmations poems and prayers and really it's my story of pain to purpose so being able to you know share with everyone like despite the things that you go through being able to find hope in the midst of it you know dealing with you know brokenness depression suicidal thoughts that I've you know dealt with in the past this was really, you know, my way of expressing and really getting getting out what was inside that I was, you know, building up, that was building up from the past. And so um, I share that story and how, like, that healing journey, how I found my voice, you know, how I was able to really just hold on to my faith, mm -hmm. you know, and that was a huge part. This book is my foundation um, because it was, you know, poems, prayers, and affirmations I've written over the years mm -hmm. since my childhood. Mm -hmm. And so it really allowed me to, um, you know, to finally, I was able to finally get it out. And so now I just, you know, hope and also have feedback that it has been, you know, helpful for others. Good. You know, you have chosen the positivity here. You know, yes. there's some things that have happened in your life that right. some people might say, well, you know, why are you so upbeat? Right. <laughs> why are you, yeah. how are you, you know, good right now? But, right. you know, that's a, it's a, a choice mm -hmm. that you have made and have been all the better for it. Though, right. right. Absolutely. And so being able to, um, let people know like your your past doesn't have to define your future and so really learning how to um, allow yourself to affirm yourself you know learning how to get outside that's a really big thing too um, that I express like being able to express gratitude and I've actually you know started what's called the the flowers gratitude walk challenge based off of there's one of the poems that I talk about gratitude being like the secret ingredient to you know um, the 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 thing that depression always fears mm. is when we are able to be grateful because most times when you're depressed you've gone through things you can't really see like what is there to be grateful for right now but I really you know express you know being able to get outside and and look at the beauty around you and like being able to see you know the beautiful side of life yeah because as you mentioned you know you may be thinking oh man I'm down right now right. there's nothing for me right now yeah. but if you really stop to think about it you can absolutely find something out there yes. that you can be grateful for so I think right. that's wonderful that you have honed in on that let's absolutely. let's do that and then we're gonna feel better yes we're gonna do better yes. and, you know when we feel good right so you have an event coming up people can yes. come out and meet with you at absolutely. the at the library right yes it's on September 16th at 2 p.m. I will be at the Wood County Library sharing about my book answering any questions meet and greet so I'm definitely looking forward to it I hope everyone joins and uh, yeah it's gonna be good yeah and you also have a podcast you have a website yes. so people can catch you in a multiple mediums <laughs> oh yeah absolutely so my podcast is affirmations journey with flowers and so I go on there I share you know different tips every week I drop a new episode so being able to you know find some some excitement you know throughout your day some inspiration to get through the week and so I have that and then on my website kflowers.com kflowers with a Z that's where everybody can you know check out the different things that got going on you know it's it'll be nice to plug maybe that podcast or something into your earbuds and oh, maybe yeah. go for a walk or something oh, like yeah. that you know yeah. that, that'll really boost your mood right oh absolutely and the thing about it is all of my episodes are less than five like usually 
less 10 minutes or less. Okay. So I've had people say that, hey, I'm binging your podcast right now, and it, I just want to keep it super easy, mm -hmm. listen, inspiration, and you know, you can continue to go through out your day. So yeah. Very good. If somebody wants the book, where can they get it? Yes, it's available on Amazon.com, mm -hmm. or if you email uh, email me on my website, mm -hmm. I can send you a signed copy of oh, my book. Wonderful. Very good. So pick that up. Also come out in for the meet and greet at the library on the 16th of September. Thank you so much for coming this morning, helping thank us feel me. better today. Yes, yeah, it's absolutely. a good day, right? Yes, <laughs> absolutely. It's a good day. Yes, thanks for being here. <laughs> thank well, you. Well, next on Toledo's longest running 9 a.m. show, Gourmet Water, Sleeping Upright in Lions, Protecting Toledo's Oldest Building. Yeah, there's a lot happening next. That's coming up when Good Day returns. Stay with us.